So this is kind of a random haul video, which you could tell from the title. Um, if I don't know, I have a question actually um, for you guys before I start the haul because as some of you know, I was absent from YouTube for so long. Of course, even though I was absent for YouTube, I was still buying beauty products and I always had the intention of doing hauls on these products. Um, and I don't know. I don't know if I should make the hauls with just a few items at a time so they don't get too long because you guys all know I tend to be very wordy in their long videos. So if I should make, you know, just try to stick with like 10 products at a time or if I should do more and show more products at a time. So let me know what you guys like. Um, I'm just gonna do this video and see how long it is. I'm not sure, see how it goes. I'll try to make it as quick as possible. But yeah, let me know what you guys prefer. The second thing is I wanted to say, the stuff that I've purchased, or I'm gonna show you in this video, is all pretty recent because like I said, I don't remember what I showed and what I haven't. And I don't know, if there is a repeat, I don't think there is, I think because the stuff is all pretty new, but if there is, I apologize, there might be one or two things just because I'm very unorganized. I put all my stuff in a drawer and what I should do is separate what I have hauled for you and what I haven't, but I don't do that. So that being said, let me get into it. The first thing I picked up is this Bobbi Brown SPF Protective face base broad spectrum. I actually ran out of my sunscreen. I wear sunscreen every day, Dermalogica. I've worn Dermalogica sunscreen for years. Um, they just changed the name of it. They like reformulated it. So I can't even tell you the name of it. All I know is the old name, which they don't make anymore. But I wanted to try something new, uh, especially because my Dermalogica is only SPF 30 and this one's SPF 50. There's no parabens in this one. So I was very interested. I love the texture. I tried it when I, um, the day I went to the mall and got this at Macy's, I tried it on. I really liked it, so I'm hoping I like this. Not that I don't love the Dermalogica one, I just am super an advocate for sunscreen. And so I really wanted to, when I heard this was SPF 50 and I was hearing good things about this, I was like, oh, I really wanna try it because I just, I'm, I mean, I really am an advocate for sunscreen. The, the higher the the higher the percentage, you know, the broad, broad spectrum, the better it is. So I got that. Okay, there's two things I got from the balm. The balm, it always sounds like I'm saying the balm like in the 90s, like that's bomb. If you guys are children of the 90s, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but they were having a 50% off sale, literally 50% off everything from their website. I guess they redid their website and so I ordered two things. These are two things I've been wanting for a while, literally. I've been wanting this new tube palette for at least a year. So I finally went down and went broke down and got it with 50% off. I mean, 50% off, you can't beat that. So here are the colors. I'm not gonna swatch anything in this video, honestly, because there's too much and I don't wanna make it 40 minutes long. If you guys have a particular question or want me to swatch something, let me know. Um, otherwise, I'm not gonna do it just because it'd be way too long. The second and last thing I got from The Balm is this Hot Mama. It's a shadow blush highlighter. It's kind of a multi-purpose thing. I got the sample in my birch box. I used it once and then I accidentally threw it away. I was so mad at myself. And yes, you better believe I went out to the trash can. <laughs> I tried to like, the, it was trash day. It always happens to me. I threw it out that morning and the trash man had already come. I'm like, really? He always comes late. The one day I need him to come late, he came early. But anywho, so I went ahead and bought this full size because I really did like it in my Birchbox sample. And it's a really big blush. And with 50% off, you couldn't beat it. It's like a pinky, corally, um, shimmery. I just liked it. I really like it. And they're, I have to say, the balm, their packaging is super cute. They always have the cutest stuff. So then I went to Target and I got a couple things, just, you know, um, inexpensive little things that I'd heard good things about. I got this by e.l.f. It's the Contouring Blush and Bronzing Powder Duo. And these are supposed to be dupes from what I heard um, from a YouTube video of NARS's Laguna and Orgasm, I believe. And I saw this from Tanya Burr. She, she talked about this and how much she liked it. So it's just those, you can see it's like the Orgasm Blush and like the Laguna Bronzer. I just bought this, I haven't tried it yet, but it was three bucks, you can't beat it. It's three bucks, Elf stuff is so inexpensive. So, and my, my Target carries it, so I just picked it up when I was at Target. I pretty much live at Target, so I'm there all the time. The next thing I got is also from Target. It's this Milani Shadow Eyes Eyeshadow Pencil, and it's in the color Brown Deluxe. And this was in a video by, oh, what's her name? I know her name, it's Ingrid, but I don't know her channel's name. I am blank, I'm blanking. Is it Miss Glamorazzi? Or is that someone else? And that's it, right? That's her name. I just keep showing you this product while I'm thinking. Um, but she featured this in one of her videos, so I wanted to pick it up and try it because I really liked it on her. And then also from Target, sorry, I'm looking. I have that, I just put a bunch of stuff in bags so I could show you. Oh, here it is. I got this from Target, just an 
eye sharpener also from Milani, but I wanted to mention this because it's so hard to find eye, sharp eye sharpeners. I don't know what it is about it, but um, the last one I found was at Ulta. And I, you know, these ones you don't use forever because they start to get gunky and like it's not worth cleaning. I mean, they're like two bucks. So just to buy a new, like when they start to get gunky and stuff, I just want to buy a new one. The CoverGirl one I bought sucked. So I wanted to tell you guys about this one because the Milani one actually works really good. I really like it. This is the second one I've gotten. And I mean, obviously I haven't used this one, but I used the old one and it works really, really, really well. And it's three bucks and Target always has it. So that's nice. So I got that at Target. I also got this Vaseline Spray and Go in Cocoa Radiant. They have a couple um, like scents available. So I saw the commercial, it sucked me in. I really wanted to try it. So we'll see how it goes. Cause I'm always running late in the morning and hopefully this will just be easier to rub in and stick my clothes on. Or rub, yeah, rub in my clothes on. All right, the next thing I got, I'm trying to see if I have anything else from Target. So let me look through my, no, I think that's it for Target. So I got a couple things from drugstore.com. Sorry, I'm a mess right now. So I got from drugstore.com. Uh, these three eyeshadow palettes from Wet n Wild. I got these at least a month ago, I want to say. I got the one in Blue Had, wait, Blue Had Me at Hello, Comfort Zone, and Petal Pusher. And um, drugstore.com, I get free shipping through them, and they had a sale, like buy one, get one half off or something. So I got these three, and I have to say, I've heard so many good things about them, but I didn't believe it, because I'm really like, $3 for an eyeshadow, eyeshadow palette, and people are saying they're amazing. So I had to try it, honestly. These were really good. Very good pigmentation, they're very soft, very blendable. I'm impressed. I'm very, very, very impressed. Like all the hype about these eyeshadow palettes is true. And I definitely want to start trying the ones that have just three shadows because I've heard good things about those too. So I picked those up. And then I also picked up, sorry, I have different bags here. I'm trying to bond stuff. Oh, I got this. Um, Palmer's Cocoa Butter, Dark Chocolate, and Peppermint Lip Butter. You guys know I'm obsessed with lip butters because I have very chopped lips. I have a habit of peeling them. And this stuff smells just like, it smells just like a York Peppermint Patty and it tastes just like a York Peppermint Patty. And it's amazing. And I, who recommends, Zoella, her, um, you know, she's like the English girl. She's super cute. She recommended this and I wanted to try it because I'm always looking for new chopsticks. It's only like two, three bucks maybe. And this works really, really good. Sorry. My guard dogs want high Sorry guys. Um, so just think of them. The other day I have to say, um, someone rang my doorbell at like 11 o'clock at night and my husband, was, he's gone for 24 hours at a time for work. And my dogs freaked, I freaked out. I was freaking out, my dogs were freaking out, and I could not get them to calm down the rest of the night. They're my little guard dogs. Okay, so the next thing I got is from dermstore.com. It's Vitality Lip Flush by It Cosmetics. I got this, I saw it um, featured on QVC. It actually looks clear. I'm sorry guys, they won't stop for like an hour, so there's no point in me stopping and refilming in five minutes. Um, but it looks clear and it goes on pink. I'm actually wearing it right now. That pink color is this lipstick. It's by It Cosmetics and it's in the color Je ne sais quoi. I really like it. Super moisturizing. It gives you a pop of color. I'm kind of wearing dark makeup today because, um, not dark makeup, but like purpley or folly because it's cold and rainy where I'm living right now. Um, but this would be a really good color for spring. It doesn't really go with my eye makeup right now, but I really, really like that. The next thing I got is from, what have I shown you? What haven't I? I think two more stores. So I went to Victoria's Secret today. I had some secret rewards I wanted to use and I had, I'm sorry, Jackson. Come on, buddy. He gets so upset. <laughs> um, but I had some uh, secret rewards I wanted to use and I had, I wanted to buy, I wanted, specifically wanted there to buy a Razorback bra. They didn't have my size that I wanted and the color I wanted, so I ordered online. But I found this really um, good smelling perfume. It's their sparkling citrus line and it's in the scent lemon sugar coconut. Jackson! I'm sorry. If I knew how to edit better, I'd edit all this out, but I don't. 
Um, and it smells, I have to say, when you spray it on, the lemon pretty much dissipates very, very quickly. And all that's left behind that lingers is this really warm coconut smell. My husband loves coconut, so I was like, oh yeah, I definitely gotta give it a try. And honestly, I have it right here. It smells really good. It just smells like warm, toasty coconut. There's no other way to describe it. It was only $12. I used one of my secret rewards card, which is only, it was 10 bucks. I paid like $2 for this. Okay. Sorry, my voice is going too, because my dog was trying to get a bunny earlier and I was screaming at the top of my lungs, freaking out. I thought he was gonna get this bunny. So my voice is not doing good. All right, the very last store I'm gonna show you guys is from TooFaced.com. And Too Faced had a really good deal going on. Um, I normally don't order things directly from cosmetic websites like The Balm or Too Faced. Actually, I actually have two stores I wanna show you, sorry. Um, but I don't usually order things directly from websites. I usually go to Sephora or Ulta. But I have, over the last few years, ordered, you know, sometimes things from Too Faced when they have 20% off or their family and friends sale. Oh, sorry, it's really starting to bother me now. So they had a deal going on or I'm sorry, my whole point was when you spend so much over time, it's like, a, it's kind of like Sephora. It's like a club where you're in certain levels. Well, I, you know, I must have at some point accumulated enough. So now I just reached level one status. So when you reach level one status, your next order, you get like a free gift. And then they had a promo going on where if you spend so much, you get like this free makeup palette. And then they had like a discount, 10% off or something. So I got all this, it was like a really good deal that I got all this stuff. So the two things I actually, I paid for it and get for free. I'll show you those first. So, wait, if I can find them in my bag of clutter. Where is it? Did I put it? Okay, it's here. It's hiding. Sorry. Okay, so the first thing is this um, Sweetheart Beads. It's part of their summer collection. All right, I gotta speed it up. <laughs> um, it's a little cardboard container. It's essentially. I'm trying not to make a mess here, but it's essentially these little beads are shaped like hearts. You can't really tell. But it's like a highlighter powder, kind of like a take on the um, the Guerlain, you know, like their beads, like shimmer highlighting. I don't, I don't remember what the Guerlain ones were called, but it's like that. So I'm really excited. I've been super into highlighting powders. If you watch me, I mean, blushes and highlighting powders I've been buying like crazy. Cause honestly, I use the same color blush and that's exclusively what I use for like six, seven years, and now I've been branching out and buying all kinds of blushes and buying all kinds of highlighters, and I don't even think I owned a bronzer up until like two months ago. So I've been buying way too many of those products recently. And the second item I paid for at Too Faced was the Snow Bunny Bronzer. Um, I actually read the reviews on Sephora, and it was like four and a half or five stars out of the five stars. And this is a bronzer. It's just like different shades. You mix them all together. And people have really good things to say about it. And like I said, I really, I think this is the first bronzer that I've purchased. Um, and then that little elf one had a little bronzer in it. So I'm excited because it's had really, really good reviews. So I got that. Okay, now to the free stuff. So like I said, you get a free gift when you're level one. This is a free gift I got. And I think it's like worth 12 or $13. It's a sample of the deluxe, or it's a deluxe sample of Lash Injection 2 Mascara and then deluxe sample of the Perfect Eyes Eyeliner. It's called their Cat Eyes Kit. And you can actually buy this on their website. So this is the free gift I got for being a level one. I'm not gonna open it and stuff because I'm running super late. So I got that for free. And then I also got two free samples because every order you place on TooFaced.com, you always get your choice of two free samples. So I got, if I can get my other one, where is it? I should have it all laid out, but like all my school works out here, so I don't want to, and it's like an order, I don't want to get it all jumbled up. Okay, so I got a sample of the Lash Gaza Mascara, which I have used before, I'm not crazy about it. So I think I'm gonna give this to my friend who's um, was asking me today um, for a couple samples. So I'm gonna give this to her. And then I also got a sample of the Flirt Glamour Gloss, and it's like a brownie pink color. Pretty good sample size, nice to throw in your purse. And then the last free thing I got, because I spent so much, was this Too Faced, palette. It's their Love Sweet Love palette. And it is like this. And it's like a little book. It's a little mirror, a couple little pages, some like tutorial stuff in there. And then it has six eyeshadows, I think a bronzer, a blush, and then two lip glosses. 
So, hey, for free, I was all about that. Cause those are the bronzer and the bead products. I already wanted those. So it was a perfect time to order because I got you know all this extra free stuff with it. So that is all the cosmetic stuff. And the very last thing I wanted to show you was I stopped by Forever 21 today. And I picked up two other shirts. I know I just did a big haul from Forever 21. Um, but you know, I was looking for a couple easy shirts to wear for school. There's certain days at school we don't have to wear our scrubs. We can just wear regular clothes. Today was one of those days. I have to be there early. I like wearing clothes that are really comfortable because I tend to be there all day. Even after class is over, we have to go to lab and do stuff. So I like comfy things. So I got this shirt, just have little um, bicycles on it. It's kind of like a heather effect shirt. It's kind of see through -y. Wear a tank underneath it. It's only $12.80. The second shirt I thought got is so soft, so comfortable. It's like a burnout tee. It's navy blue and white striped. I love baseball type tees and it has just heather grade sleeves. Honestly, it is so soft, so comfortable. I thought this would be super cute just to throw on um, on days I'm running late and just wanna be comfortable and you know, whatever. So that's everything I got. Honestly, I tried to make that short and it's still 16 minutes. So really, I'd really appreciate feedback and let me know if you guys want me to do short little condensed videos with just a few products. And if so, rec you know, tell me how many products you'd recommend. Like is five good, six, seven, or if you don't mind these longer videos, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I can be annoying. So <laughs> let me guys know what you guys would prefer and I will try to tailor that. It might be better too. I'm just, I'm wearing myself out trying to get all this information as fast as I can. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you soon.